coming from an 0-16, 1-15 year, new rookie head coach. Honestly, I'm excited for next year. Browns are winning the next 10 Super Bowls. It was a fantastic year. Next year, you better watch out. Let's go, baby! Let's go. A lot of optimism among Browns fans despite the loss to the Chiefs. Some fans wanted to thank players in person for this special season. News 5's Emily Hamilton is live at Hopkins Airport right now, but Emily fans won't be able to get quite as close to the team plane as they had hoped. No, Tracy, they're not able to, but they are not letting this rain or snow on their parade. You can hear the energy. You can feel it behind me here. We're told by Cleveland police that they've been asked to enforce NFL COVID-19 protocols. So these fans aren't able to get as close to the team as they were last week, but that has not stopped them. Some of these people showing up around 7 o'clock tonight. They've been here all night, and we've already got these players headed out. Uh, those planes landed about 20 minutes ago. Some of those players rolling down their windows saying thank you to these fans that have waited outside in the snow for them and waited 18 long years for a playoff run. With COVID, with all like the cases and stuff, everyone was down, but the Browns kind of, you know, winning all these games have really cheered people up around the city. It's, it's been a rough year for everybody with the pandemic and everything. And I mean, the Browns just, I mean, they gave new meaning to everything. You know, they gave us a lot to look forward to. Amazing year. We finally got the quarterback of the future. <laughs> Thank you, Cleveland. We finally got the right coach, too. Here we go, Brownies. Here we go. <laughs> Have you ever seen the Browns as good? Oh, yeah. Not this good, no. Well, no, 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 not, not this good. <laughs> Thank you, Cleveland. It's been 18 long years since we've been in the playoffs. Who is your favorite player and why? Uh. Baker Mayfield because he's 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 Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield. <laughs> Since we can't go out anymore because COVID is something that us as a family can enjoy and have fun with. I'm happy with the season even though he lost to Kansas City to the Chiefs. Win or lose, we love the Browns. Yeah. It's been so many years since we've gotten this far that it just even with the tough loss, I I'm just proud of them beyond belief. Proud of them. We still care for them and. This isn't just going to be like their worst game ever, and it's just, we still support them. And for those of you at home tonight who could not make it out to support the players and, and bring home those Browns, we want to give you a live look. What you're looking at right now is that player, the, the caravan of players and coaches as they arrive from Kansas City. I would say we've got about 150 to 200 loyal, diehard Browns fans out here bringing these guys home after a remarkable season. Pretty special, something to witness out here tonight, Tracy. We've seen people crying. We've seen young kids with signs who say they're so pumped to be off school tomorrow because they got to stay up past their bedtime to support the Browns. So we want to just leave you with a last look uh, as some of those players head out, um, you know, this has been a long time in the making for the Cleveland Browns and the city of Cleveland. So really, really special to witness out here.